Hey guys, what's up? Um, so today I'm going to be making a salad and I'm also going to be addressing something that, um, is, I, I really fucking hate so much putting on, like, uh, putting, like writing stuff because I'm not going to sit there and squabble in the, um, comments with idiots. Do you know what I mean? Like, I just will not. Um, I can't type. I don't type. My nails are very long, so I use a microphone to text. I think I'm going to sit there and discuss how you're dumb. Like, no, I'm just not. So, um, I just don't. And I let people fight amongst themselves in comments. And if I'm annoyed enough, I will come on here and broach it, as I typically do. I'm also very out of breath because I'm five months pregnant now. And... I'm a, I'm a pig and I hate pregnancy and I don't want to say that because it's not nice. I feel like what people say, it's okay to say that, like you're allowed to be thankful you're pregnant. And also, I don't, I don't think I, I'm not sure if I have a cold or if I'm congested because I'm pregnant. Like, is this just the worst? Anyway, I'm feeling a little bit better because, um, like right around now is when I've been like so sick. Yes, I'm a blob. Okay. I am a blob. I'm like barefoot Contessa fat. Okay, yes, I am. That is me. Stop. No, I do not wash iceberg lettuce. Like, are you dumb? I'm not washing iceberg lettuce. You're not eating this down my face. Um, see, so I can't even do anything without you guys sitting here and judging the fuck out of me for not washing iceberg ass lettuce. Okay? This is clean. Shut up. Get away from me. Just get the fuck away from me. So, um, I'm going to. Yes, and the cat is walking on the table because it's my fucking house. So, so anyway, I'm going to make this salad. And I have, like, not, um, to be honest, I'm not making sure he doesn't show his butthole because, like, cats do that. It's really gross. So, like, you know what I mean? Like, they just do that. You know what I mean? I'm like, okay, okay. So, except he is fur, so his butthole doesn't show. But, like, why do cats do that? It's weird. Okay. Um, I also don't wash my cucumber because it's wrapped. Okay, idiot, it's wrapped. I don't need your fucking comments. You're not eating this. Imagine someone without a pot to piss in telling me how things should be done. Like, get away from me. Get the fuck off my channel. Okay, I love this. Okay, so I'm just doing like this simple little salad. Look at this. This is the best thing in the world. Okay, um, so what I want to do is I want to broach. So this week I did put on Instagram something that I've broached before and People get irate about it. Like these entitled mothers get I become irate with ill-mannered children and themselves too are very trailer park. Okay. Yes, they are trailer park. My nose is running, so I need to get like something to wipe it. Okay. I'm giving like trailer park kid with like boogers running out of its nose. That's what you anyone who is like not anyone who doesn't agree with me has children with booger tubes running out of their nose. That's you, and that's a child you have. That is not the child or the vibe I will have. And don't tell me, just wait. Just wait. Oh, we're going to get in this. Yes, we are. Because I'm done with you. Just wait. Just wait what? Like, just wait what? Okay, stop. Yes, we are. So, okay. I'm eating an avocado. I would never in a million years eat a motherfucking avocado. Because fucking fattening. I'm such a fucking whale. I'm going to eat less than half. Um, okay, so I just want to like sit down and collect my thoughts, but anyway, what it, what it is, is I said, can we please like not like, why, why is it, why do mothers just like whip their tits out in the middle of public or on the internet to breastfeed their child? Like what? And there's construction workers here. That's why there's noises. Just so you know, why do you, why do they do that? Okay. And this is why I love putting this out there because I'm allowed to now defend what I'm saying. Not defend, I, dude, I'm not even, it's like, I can't even believe I have to defend this. I, I cannot even fucking believe I have to defend this. What the fuck has happened to society today? Okay, I'm going to breastfeed, obviously. A lot of people don't. I don't give a fuck what you do with your kid. The fucking least you do with your, less you do with your kid, the better it is for my kid to fucking, you know, be up in the world. I don't give a fuck how you raise your damn child. That's the truth. I don't care. I'm also putting cheese on here. Like, wow, who am I? I don't know. I would never eat this in normal. Don't feed your cat cheese. I don't care. He wants a piece. Shut up. He wants a fucking piece of cheese. 
No, he doesn't. And if he did, then he would have a piece. Okay, get the fuck out of here. Okay. So, um, this is it so far. Um, and then I have some beets. I'm going to put them on. Some salt and pepper. I have banana peppers too. Um, there's a cat hair. Yes, there is. Cat hair. Oh, before I continue with this too, I need to remind you guys that um, my stocking stuffers are still available, but my entire site is also 10% off right now. So you can get stocking stuffer designs, which are going to be either raised to their normal selling price in January, or they're going to be gone from the, the line. It's just, that's how my bougie stocking stuffers work. So take advantage of this now. This is the last like promo or whatever offer of the year. 10% off the whole site plus the stocking stuffers are 10% off. So it's crazy. Like you guys know how good stocking stuffers are. I'm wearing a bunch of them right now. I'll show you up close. Just believe me, like it's crazy. Yeah, there's a cat hair on here. And I don't care. I would eat it if I had to and shit. Oh, look, you guys don't have pets. You guys have kids with shit in their ass and fucking boogers and your tits out, but you're telling me about a cat on the table. Oh my God. Yeah, okay. Look, you see the retardation? You're telling me about a cat on the table and not washing a lettuce, but you have, but you're have put, you're taking out your fucking tit in the middle of the mall. Out of here. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, so I'm gonna put some bacon. This is way too much bacon. I'm just gonna take two pieces, and I'll save the rest for I don't know what later or something. Um. Okay, so I just gotta, I, I'm not like coherent right now um, because I'm distracted. So, this is kind of like a cob salad, I guess. I don't know. And let me just get some beets. The beets are like draining in the um, sink. There's some beets. And I wanted to do hearts of palm too, but I don't have any. I thought I had some. Okay, just some beets. I don't think I'm gonna put those banana peppers in. Oh, I hate cooking on camera because it's like really hard. You guys know you never. No one's ever like you guys. Luckily, they haven't tried it, so you don't know. Yes, I'm touching my hair. Um, I'm getting a phone call. It's so rude. Okay, so I'm just gonna do some salt. And some pepper. Okay. And then I got this ranch from um, Trader Joe's. And I never tried it. Let's try it. It's okay. Not a lot. Um, it's kind of a lot. Okay. Like that. And then I'm going to go toss it. And I will be back. Okay. Hey. Um, sorry if it's loud out. Like I said, there's construction work, construction workers and they're talking, but okay. So before I get started, I want to remind you guys, oh, I told you guys about, um, the 10% off additional right now, plus my entire site, 10% off, but I want to show you, this is the BB, um, cross. It's from my stocking stuffer. So it's one of the things that you can get an additional promo price on. This is my studio 54, 10 K gold necklace. It's the best. If you guys want to invest in a 10 in like a real gold piece that you can wear every day, that is just like the best chain ever get the studio 54. This is the 16 inch. I wear it all the time. You guys know I love it. This is my rose crystal tennis necklace. It's an actual tennis necklace with like a real clasp in the back. And it's absolutely gorgeous. The, of course, it's just not sitting right like when I'm talking in this light, but the prettiest pink crystals ever. And then um, this is my everyday gleam rosary 14K gold filled. It's just an amazing layering piece. It's really like radiant and sparkly. And this is my glossy angel letter. It's also one of my stocking stuffers. And to be honest, it's not that popular. And I'm like, I don't get it. I love it so much. I wear it all the time. Like it's one of those things where I like thought that you guys would love it and you, you're ordering it, but it's not like one of the most popular pieces. And I'm like, don't order if you don't want, but like, I'm telling you it's gorgeous. Okay. I don't care if you order this, whatever, but I'm telling you it's amazing. And this is so pretty. This is in 14 inches. If you like the way it sits on me. Um, okay. These are also a part of the stocking stuffer. These are the studio, the seventies studio earrings. They are so gorgeous. These will stay on the line and they will be way more expensive 
And right now you can get them at that low price plus 10% off. Do not miss out. I make the best earring set sets ever. I have so many earring sets for the stocking stuffers. This is the time to get them. I promise you like they are just, I make them so they are so gorgeous. They, I, I like put, to, put them together so they are so gorgeous on the ear because I don't like my earlobes. So I do like cool, I, I put together the best ear stacks ever, just believe me. So those are like the best savings right now. Um, this is just one design. Okay, sorry. Anyway, I'm sniffing because I'm disgusting. Okay. So do not miss out. I don't know when the 10% promo will end, but it's not going to be going forever. So I can't tell you, maybe another week. I'm not sure, but order now last promo of the year. Okay. So, um, this is bothering me that the rose is not, it's just, did I try put it? Have I put it on wrong? Probably. I probably put it on the wrong fucking way. Okay. It was on backwards. So now you can see how pretty it is. Okay. Of course I put it on backwards. Um, okay. Let me show you guys my salad. My hair looks like shit. So, um, this is what I'm going to be eating. Let me just have a couple bites with you and then I'm going to get into this subject, but I don't think I can eat and talk at the same time. I think I did the cucumbers too thin. Mm. Ew. Mm, it's good, but the cucumbers are weird. Like they're like too thin for the salad. You know what I mean? Mm. I don't know. It's not the greatest. The cucumbers really messed it up. It's really sad. Okay. I'll eat this in a sec. I just want to um, broach this, situa this to the topics with you guys for today. I ate. Okay. Um, so. Okay. Here we go. So, you dumb fucks. Um, I'm on here right now to broach what you did to me last week, okay? Um, I do not take this lightly. I think it's very rude that you think that you can come on my page and be dumb when I'm not... First of all, it's like, just you're just you're egregiously stupid. You're willingly dumb. Willingly dumb. And I'm going to get into all the points now. And I will tell you, if you leave a thesis here, I don't care. And I will probably delete it if it, you're... If it has a sense that it's irritating, I will just delete it because I don't like that you think that you can just come on my page and leave a turd, okay, from your disgusting ass. Um, no, that's not how it works here. This is my channel. Get the fuck off. These are my opinions and I'm right. Okay, so I wrote a, twi a tweet and I posted on Instagram and I do it on purpose because fuck you. Do you know what I mean? Um, you will hear the truth. And if I give a shit about followers, I wouldn't block everyone left and right. And I wouldn't post this kind of stuff. So I don't care. I could give two fucks. Okay. Um, the truth needs to be said because this like, this country is coming to a fucking like, like, like it's just done. Like American excellence is no more. There's no such thing. It's just garbage. Like we are just disgusting. We are trash. Like we don't offer, like, I feel like we, like we're just losing it. We're starting to lose it. Like look at the other countries. Children are just like totally like surpassing us. Like we're disgusting. And it just, it's just because of the parenting. It is. Okay. So um, what I wrote is, and don't tell me, okay, we'll get into it. So I wrote uh, something along the lines of, um, and you can go see it on my Instagram or my tweet, my Twitter. Um, why do moms feel the need to like take out their tit in public to breastfeed their child? why do you do that? <clears throat> there are so many just reasons why it does makes absolutely no sense for you to do that. Me as someone who will be breastfeeding my child, like maybe I won't be able to, I don't know. I know sometimes certain kids like don't breastfeed, but I plan on doing that. I was breastfed. Like, you know what I mean? Like it's for me, it's normal. Like for me, it's what I'm going to do for me. It's the right thing to do. Like, I don't know if you don't want to, I don't give a fuck what you do. Like I said, um, why do you do that? Why do you think that's okay? We have evolved from the jungles. Yes, we have. We are a civil society here. What makes it, why do you think you should just in a public place 
take your fucking tit out of your shirt and plop it somewhere and put your child's mouth on it in public. Why do you, what, what happens in your brain where you think that's normal behavior? You're trash. Yes, you are. What is so hard about getting a little shroud, okay, or a, a very thin sheet, something, okay, just to put it over for a little bit of modesty? Like, where is the, do you have, have you no shame? You're disgusting. You're disgusting, floppy, nursing mommy tit is vile, okay? You may think it's beautiful, just like you may think that your kids are the most are the most beautiful best things in the world, but we don't. So many so many, most of us out here don't. Your family may keep it to your family just like okay, I don't want to get a, a beyond myself because I don't want to lose my train of thought. This really pisses me the motherfuck off. It is so much more than like just not being classy. Like it is disgusting and it's weird. So, and then everyone, okay, this is the thing too. I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna start jumbling, but I don't care because now I'm getting really fucking mad. So, so many of these moms out there, these like, they're heathen mothers. They're jungle heathen mothers, okay? They're like the have not involved from like caveman days, okay? We live in a civil society. Put a fucking shroud over your damn tit, okay? I don't wanna fucking see that. It's disgusting. It's weird, okay? You are weird. No one thinks it's beautiful. You may. And I'm sure I will too, even though whatever. Like, but no one wants to see that. It's gross. Okay, it's weird. You're weird, okay? And there's something wrong with you. Also, what are you like that? Do, are you like taking your cock and like slapping your fucking husband in the face? Or do you not have a husband? Because what kind of a man would tolerate that? Like I would, my husband would just be like, like he, he would probably die. You know what I mean? Like I can't imagine if my mom did that with my father around in public, breastfeeding her child with her tit out. Like, are you kidding? Have you no respect for your fucking man? Of course you don't because you're an idiot. Okay. And you probably don't even have a fucking man because that's how, because a man wouldn't allow that. That's a thing. They just wouldn't. But because you have no one to like put you in your place, you act a fool. Okay. Yes, you do. Um, anyway, so, so many mothers were coming for me, heathen mothers, jungle mothers, were coming for me and be like, just, just wait, just wait, just wait. They keep on saying this to me, just wait. Just wait what? Just wait, you think you're gonna see me take my tit out of my shirt and put it in public, expose it in public and put my fucking spawn on, on my tit to feed in public? Is that what you think is gonna happen? Um, that will never happen. I'm not insane, I'm not weird, I'm not like, a psycho. I'm not a like a woke fuck. You know what I mean? That's weird. And a lot of a lot of you guys out there are not woke, and you do it. And I don't get it. Put a fucking muslin cloth over. It. Have some fucking decency. You're weird, okay? And a lot of people are like, oh, the baby doesn't like the baby. Just, just wait. Wait till your baby doesn't like blanket. Then it remove yourself from public. Yes. Go in the bathroom and feed your fucking kid. You're weird. We live in a civil society, okay? We don't live in the jungles anymore. You're weird. Okay, you're very, that's very weird. Okay, I can't, what is the word for it? It's not even weird, it's just so inappropriate to do. Someone also said, which I thought was really funny, um, which I know a lot of you guys will not agree with. You're like, cause someone was like, it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing like to do. Like it's a beautiful, like same thing. Like you think it's beautiful for you to whip your fucking disgusting tit out in public to feed your child. You think it's beautiful, but we don't. But you know what is also beautiful is like actually a natural, oh, they said it was natural, is taking a shit. It's true. Someone wrote this on my Instagram page and whoever it was, he's, I think it was a boy, totally correct. Taking a shit is very natural and it's actually like, it's a beautiful thing, especially if you can't take a shit and not being able to feel that like relief. That's very sad. Do you know what I mean? So just because if I want to take a shit, should I just fucking take a grunting ass shit in public just because I want to and because it's natural? Like, have we no humility? Like, what has happened to this fucking society where you can just run a fucking muck everywhere? I, I just can't. Okay. It also goes along with the same like thing where m mothers have ill-mannered children running the motherfuck around acting like trailer trash, okay? Trailer park, okay? And don't come for me. I didn't grow up rich. Don't, I didn't grow up in a trailer park, but don't act like, oh, that's, don't be like, Alex, I grew up in a trailer park. I didn't act like that. I don't care, okay? It's called a um, stereotype and shut up, okay? So yes, it's very giving trailer park when you let your fuck it, or like, just like a mother, I mean, it's not an EIS trailer park, but it's also like those moms who 
have like so much money or they just don't like control their kids and the kids like run around like a fucking brat and I want to pull it by its hair so it shuts the fuck up you know what I mean so it's that it's like people like parents who do not rear their children and tell it to shut up okay you may think that your child do you remember what I said and this has gone viral so many times children should be seen and not heard it's a it's an old adage and it's a thousand percent true children should be seen and not heard you should be a child should be should know its place okay like what has happened she like okay anyway it's the same it's the same train of thought it's the same kind of person who would breastfeed their fucking child in public with no shroud i didn't say you can't breastfeed yes breastfeed your child in public with a cloth absolutely i will i don't i will probably do that i, I will with a with something over have some modesty you're disgusting um it's the same kind of person who lets their kid run a fucking muck and is loud and obnoxious um, as a as a mom who would um, breastfeed their child without a shroud, put their tit out in public, okay? Um, you know, it's the same thing with a dog. Like, Ming, I love Ming, and so many people love Ming, but I know that everyone loves dogs. So if we're somewhere and Ming runs up to someone, I won't let her do that. I will pull the dog back because I know not everyone is a dog person. As adorable and, like, sweet and clean and nice as she is i'm self-aware that people don't like not everyone likes a dog especially a some a stranger's dog okay it's weird so i will pull the dog back ming ming come back or come like i will just say no 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 and like whatever you know i will not do that like why don't you have any self-awareness so it's the same thing with parents that let their kids run amok it's just like it's just trash anyway i have another thing i wanted to bring up too about this um like i'm just thinking of like like classy people in life like okay kate middleton is classy um like who do you guys think is classy like melania is cl is classy even though you're like i know like the other people out there like the you know like some people give jill some people give melania like it is what it is do you think that like classy people do you think like royalty would whip their motherfucking tit out in public like do you not see why can you not understand that there's just i don't understand why i would have to say this like anyone with any sort of class would never do this. The fact that I'm even having to bring this up is so bizarre to me. Like, I, I can't believe this is a fight. And yes, it was like, people got insane. And it's weird. Like I, you guys, I will never, and the whole just wait thing. Okay, yeah, here we go. Just wait, just wait, like, just wait what? These people keep telling me just to wait with like laughing emojis. Just wait what? Just wait what? Like, I don't understand. I really swear to fucking God, I don't understand what the motherfuck you're talking about. Just wait? Just wait I'm, that I'm going to allow my child to uh, to scream at a restaurant or I'm going to um, not not like reprimand it or teach it or control the situation. Just wait. What? Just wait. I'm going to let it scream in the backyard. Like, wh what are you doing? Like, no, my, my child is not going to be an obnoxious piece of shit. No, it will not. You'll be taught correctly. Like, I, I don't understand this. Just wait. What? Child, my child gonna go up and start to striking conversation with an adult in an adult conversation? Absolutely the fuck not. There's a time and a place. Children need to be seen and not heard. They need to show some fucking respect. They need to have some fucking manners and they need to fucking learn, okay? Just wait, what? Just wait, what? I'm gonna take my tit out in public and do that? Are you out of your fucking mind? Just wait, what? Just wait, what? Like what? I, I don't understand, just wait with the laughing emojis. I'm not trash, okay? If those are your behaviors, your child, that's trash, okay? You're weird and you're, this is disgusting. And you also have a bigger cock than your husband. Your husband has, it's like Will giving Will Smith. Your husband has a cock this big, okay? If you do that to your husband in public, if you put your tit out in, in public with no shroud and feed your child and you have a husband, your husband is a beta, okay? You have no respect for your husband and his dick is the size of my fucking pinky. Yes, it is. That's the truth. If you don't, and I know there's a lot of people out there. Now, look, there are some people out there who I really like who do this. They're like naturalist kind of people and whatever. You don't, we're, I'm still friends with them. I don't give a fuck. You know, I, 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 I know a couple in my head and they get all weird and I don't care because they like me still and I still like them. It's fine. Um, but like, it, it is the truth in the end. Like, for, it, it is the fucking truth, okay? And I just want to sit for a second and collect my thoughts because this is, I don't, this is not gonna be the longest video today. I know you guys are so mad. And by the way, fuck you because I don't make a long video. You guys literally have a fucking heart attack. You pooped your diaper. Um, I make a long video last week and I put a question at the end or I put like, a, I asked you as a favor and I know you don't watch the whole video now. No, I know you don't. Either you skim through like a little fucking rap ass bad student and you don't take the whole course 
or you just didn't, I don't know. So I asked you guys in my last video. I said, because my Instagrams have been shut down so many times, I don't have any pictures of myself. I have no memories. And I know a lot of you guys have screenshotted me over the past. Some, oh, I got a couple of emails of people. Thank you for doing that, by the way. Please send me the pictures you have of me. Please email me my pictures. I don't have any fucking pictures. And it's really depressing. Like, I... I want some pictures. I want some memories. Like I have no pictures of me or my bunnies. I have no pictures of me like traveling. Like it just Instagram like fucked me so rude. Like the fact that they just like no warning. Like deleted my account so many times. Like whatever. Anyway, so that is my um topic for the day. And um, if you guys haven't understood, I am for breastfeeding. Look at all these marks. Fuck. Wow. Um I am for breastfeeding, but have some decency. Like, that's just the truth. Have some motherfucking class. Have some self-awareness. Your your tits are disgusting, I'm sure, too, after pregnancy. It's not like you got some, like, hot tits. I have very cute, cute tits. Fuck is that?